will be talking about Kasiza Matai. It is his 214th birthday. Um, his birthday was on the 11th of January uh, back in 1809. So today we will get to know more about him, who actually reinvented this medical science, Spudgerick, um, back to nature. So today we will get to know. Uh, we will discuss with his real followers who have been working day and night to bring the science and spread the word around the world. So let's uh, continue and discuss with, um, we have a special, uh, Pradeep Ji as well, and Vinod Ji. So thank you very much to both of you. Thank you very much thank for having you. us here. Thank you. Sarah Viran and Sigal, thank you very much. So, um, as I got to know, and it was really interesting to know about him, Count Matai, and um, as you know, and he is Italian, so there will be very like English viewers seeing this as well. And so, uh, I would like to thank you yeah. for uh, just giving this special episode. No, uh, of course, it was needed. On the national TV. Thank yeah, you very definitely. much. Yeah, definitely. Um, obviously, as uh, Sarita has mentioned, yeah. it's the 214th birth anniversary of Count Fiza Matai. So we are here today to give tribute to him, to his great work. He's a great founder, philosopher, teacher. There's so much, obviously, you know, in, in his books, which we have read, have learned from him. So it's a great tribute to, uh, to of today. Yeah, of course. Yeah. Him. He, she used a very good yeah. words, actually. He is a reformer, he is a social worker, and, and we can just uh, let you know how. Yeah, so. um, if we, I would like to show you a few, uh, few seconds on the screen um, about who he is, so you just get a better idea. Yeah. Thank you. It's wonderful, it's yeah, absolutely this amazing. Is a, this is a photo, he's an Italian man, yeah. born and brought up in Italian, and it's a wonderful city who have given a science, scientist. Yeah. So he's a natural lover. And uh, he is uh, known as a Count Caesar Matai, and Count is the actually uh, given an award. Actually, you, if you look at him, it's like a upadhi, you know? yeah. it's like an honor. And because uh, he is uh, uh, there uh, related to the uh, wonderful castle, yeah. he lives there, and uh, as well as uh, he actually. Uh, given some, uh, uh, that's why the Pradeep said social worker because he uh, donated uh, the land. Yeah. And uh, he is uh, a very kind heart, and he has uh, so that's why the local authority. Yeah. Uh, given him uh, the the count. Uh, yeah. His his name the name as the count. Oh, okay. Yeah. So it's a very huge castle where he lives. It's yeah. a right. wonderful yes. place. Obviously, I would love see. to take the moment to show the castle to everybody. Yes. Um, on the screen, the second picture, which is the castle. It's an absolutely wonderful view. Yeah, Look a, at that. It's a still uh, uh, continue. Wow. It's uh, like a museum. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And is the uh, oldest, and he built uh, 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 with the. Uh, are very very interest very very keen to build and it take a lot of time to yeah. build this uh, ca uh, castle actually and is the castle name is La Rochetta oh, okay. is an Italian name yeah. and today is uh, actually is a wonderful tourist place too oh mm -hmm. brilliant and, uh, this is a massive castle in the Italy and to be honest uh, whenever we go there once a year or more than that whenever the program there we yeah. go there and uh, it's a wonderful and That's the history and the surrounding it's a is a look at that one is a riola there is a one village named riola is a volgana city in okay. the uh, is a is a not far from the volgana city right. is a bologna actually in yeah. we say is a bologna but in english we say volgana so so bologna city is is not far from uh, his uh, village. That's his amazing. Corinola, yeah. It's in the middle of nature as well. Yeah, <laughs> he, he had a lot of love for nature and animals. So all these uh, natural medicines, which are plant-based, which he created, you know, they're obviously wonderful. Obviously, working for over two hundred years, not just in the UK and Europe in Asia. So they're working quite all over. Yeah, and that, that's what I find really interesting because as far as I know, there is some homeopathy medicines, you know, that are made from, uh, deprived from animals or minerals or Ayurveda. Sometimes they can use animals. So it's wonderful to see this system is just purely plant-based. That is the actually uh, biggest contribution of 
काउंट में था ही आई आई बिलीव एज ए मेडिकल स्टूडेंट एज ए मेडिकल प्रैक्टिशनर और एज ए एज ए हर्बलिस्ट आई आई बिलीव माई सेल्फ दैट द मेडिकल सिस्टम शुड बी बेस्ड ऑन द नेचुरल लॉज एंड ही इज द फर्स्ट एंड टू बी ऑनेस्ट वाई आई से ही इज द फर्स्ट बिकॉज देर वार अ गैप बिटवीन द मेडिकल सिस्टम फॉर एग्जाम्पल एलकाइमी एंड स्पेसिफिक देर वॉज अ गैप ऑफ फाइव हंड्रेड ईयर्स गैप सो दैट्स वाई Right. So yes. So um, Vinodji. Yeah, Pradeep Ji. Yeah. Else? I'd just like to mention that um, Kansi Zeh Matai, yeah. our great founder, has written many books in English okay. uh, as well, uh, as well as Italian, and you know some were yeah. translated in different languages as well. Right. And uh, during that time, he actually had eighty-four depots of where his medicines, you know, when, when okay. they were made in Italy, yeah, when, when were given in eighteen eighteen fifty-nine, when mm. he introduced the world. Uh, this system of medicines and quickly within a ten years, okay. um, all over the uh, world in eighty four uh, distributed. Mm, that's amazing. Uh, and that's why uh, the the all the European and Asian countries. And you won't be believe it that uh, there were so many medical and royal families are yeah. followers. And the medical doctor was a follower of that. And how did he actually? He is an Italian man, okay. born and brought up in it. And I have a doubt that he has uh, never visited to India. Right. But he actually given a wonderful system. Jadi buti ante yoni system nita. Wow, amazing. He given a uh, he given a system of medicines on jadi buti ante. If you look at, and that's why we are just telling you one thing more thing about this is that he was uh, very much uh, uh, a, a philosopher. He studied natural science, okay. Kamal Thay, and he actually follower of the Honeyman. Oh, okay. Before that, he was a follower of the Paracelsus, right. who introduced the uh, Indian art called uh, alchemy uh, into the Europe and yeah. named spagyri. Mm-hmm. He is a follower of that, and then follower the Hippocrates. The food is a medicine. Yeah. So plus point of the Count Matty impressed me a lot is this: he put it together. Right. He put it together uh, into the one system. The the alchemy oldest art. Yeah. The the Paracelsus law similar, mm-hmm. which is again is the Indian uh, principle yeah. law of nature, and then he put it the small dilution doses of the honeyman. Okay. And he put it in three. Uh, a different system into one yeah. and compare with the medical system that time modern uh, uh, system right. which is conventional medicines that yeah. time is and uh, his mother and 1845 the vechuna the mother no cancer ho gaya si and he cannot actually as a young child yeah. he cannot see that pain no. going through so he okay. actually start learning um into into the medical system and all of sudden uh, his back or or there is a uh, some wonderful uh, uh, references that his dog yeah. or or uh, he he watching him uh, 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 from a long time he was some uh, some skin problems and using the some kind of um, rain water or, or special water there and as well as the the herbs yeah. and he he corrected so what he done is he learned something there is a something and god placed something special in the herbs and he want to find out and based on those principle he put it nature spiritual and science on all together and basically mm-hmm. homeopathic was the largest system of that time and going very fast that time he noticed some few points which actually acknowledged by the modern science today that homeopathic is using the animals yeah. chemical mm-hmm. beyond the limit dilutions potencies yeah. ready made potencies and the single remedies yeah so what actually counts is a method done rectified these all errors or or uh, put it in other word that he corrected in a such a way he actually says that that the all the principles of uh, nature is misunderstood yeah. so he put it and he put it and corrected it in a different way that, that there should not be more diluted medicines yeah. there should not be prepaid uh, uh, potencies yeah. it should be according to the disease should not be tested a medicine on animals yeah. it should not be tested on a healthy subject mm-hmm. healthy person should only be disease person okay. and then he he placed a role into the plant based system and then he put it the right way the law of similar he put it the rather than single remedy he put it the complex 
compound remedy once again. Yeah. So, so today's modern science actually pointing out the Count Caesar Matisse actually put it already 163 years ago. I would quickly like to mention that um, Dr. Vinod Kumar is the only international expert who has devoted his whole life, you can yeah. say, towards basically this creating re-establishing this after a hundred years. You. So, uh, uh, I, I think uh, uh, without um, anybody's support, it cannot be mm, uh, no, fulfilled this. So, uh, the Guru and the Kirpa Riya, and that's why it all can be done. Yeah. So, uh, without anybody's support, we can't do that. So, so it's very nice actually, and um, uh, Pradeep Ji is also uh, uh, doing a wonderful job by giving a chakra therapy. Yeah, uh, chakra uh, therapy, they're all ex external, but they, they work wonderfully as well. Yeah. That's amazing. So, yeah, thank, yeah, you. So thank you very much for you, Samita, for having me yeah, uh, here course. today for the tri uh, tribute for Camp Times 214. No, of course it was yeah, needed.